Hello and welcome to another tutorial. Right now we're going to import uh, the logo that we've done, designed in um, Illustrator, and we're going to uh, make it into a 3D image. So just uh, go to File, uh, Import, look for the file. Uh, we saved it as ADG Media for 3D, which is here. Open that, merge, yes, that's fine. Uh, single object, yes, we want it as a single object object right we've got that there if we look at the perspective view it's a bit tiny so we just scale that right click scale it up uh to about yeah yes yeah, right uh and we also want to rotate that make sure the angle snaps on press a angle snap is on 90 degrees would be fine that's great right uh alt w maximize the perspective view or whichever active viewpoint port you have we've got that there we've got the bite size how we want it to do that in in uh, max would be a bit difficult so that's why we've done it illustrator done that now all we have to do is extrude just um, go to modifier make sure it's selected and then press um, extrude You'll have to go into the modify list, but I've actually got these um, shortcut keys enabled. So I can just press extrude here. Now we go down to the parameters and change the amount. Let's make the extrusion a minus figure. It's about there. Can't really see it because it's in black. So what we're going to do is press M get the material editor up and just drag and drop the first one we get come to just to change it right now we've got the 3d version of it that looks okay that's great uh, what we want to do now press the M let's change the color to uh, go to diffuse click the diffuse and change the color we want maybe an apple green or something for this just tamper with this a bit uh, darken it up a bit yeah that'll do for this purposes just to show you how to change colors um, and put some bit of shine on it so go to the specular level crank it up a bit like we've done in previous tutorials and change the glossiness so it's a bit shiny but not too shiny like that that's good uh, close this make that a bit bigger like that and rotate it slightly again how do we want it we want it maybe now we'll leave it like that trying to get an angle set correctly how we would like it that's fine just like that's fine uh, it shows that it's 3d but it's not it's not too in-depth that's that's great Um now what I just want to do is um, animate it a bit so it can be just a, a intro to the videos that we're doing here 